The reason it's important to teach seniors the internet and about computing is because they are the ones who have traditionally been left out. We try to give them the opportunity to communicate with their loved ones. Everyone is provided an email address, internet access, and we help them to also um, access their benefits via social security, via the internet, and um, whatever they need. They can get in research on their own. It makes them feel like they're part of, 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 of society again. But you're just sitting home, you know, with, with your regular rituals, and you're not in touch. They're speaking about certain things that, that, uh, that you can do with the computer, and they just feel left out. I think it's a depressing thing. You know, I think it's self-destructing if you don't get into it because they're speaking a language that you know nothing about and they're using English words. So cloud computing is when at a remote location they have your information, you go into your device, you call it up and then it, it gives it to you. When I started out we had one computer and we all worked with one computer and we made it work. But thanks to the Internet Society, we have laptops for everyone. We have a large monitor for instruction. We have wireless everything, and we have internet access. We do provide the social services, the emotional uh, services, and what have you. But she helps us also with the intellectual services. And if you don't use it, you're going to lose it. <laughs> this world is a beautiful world. Thank God we Internet Computer Access Program. Without the Internet Society, there would be no high cap. Oh, yes, a beautiful world.